viewers, welcome back to my webinar. So today is our third session, and meron na tayong if you feature ng mga in-demand na security products. So kung sa mga previous sessions natin, we talked about biometrics for uh, timekeeping and door access, as well as yung body temperature detection, ngayon naman, we'll discuss a different type of security product. Yes, tama ka dyan. But before we get into that, i-remind muna natin ng ating mga my viewers kung ano ko ba ang dapat natin abangan for today's session. So first is, meron tayo ng exclusive one-day promo for our kitchen products for today. And aside from that, meron din tayong announcement for the winners of our Guest the Product of the Week Facebook game. So, meron din ba na ng 300 pesos worth of load? All they had to do was of course to like our page, like our post, and share, and guess kung ano yung ating featured product for today's session while tagging three of their friends. So, both yung ating exclusive na one-day promo and the winner for our Facebook game will be announced later at the end of this video. So, please stick around with us para malaman natin yung mga special announcements na yan. Okay? But for now, without further ado, let's get into today's video. So, whenever we enter almost any type of establishments, mga office man yan, malls, schools, or a uh, subdivision, especially if you have your own car or naka taxi ka or naka carpool, most probably you have already encountered the parking barrier. So these are usually made of metal bars that uh, control your entrance and exit the mga vehicles into the establishments or the parking area. Now, some of the common hassles of going through the security check is kapag manual yung parking barrier natin, it consumes more time na kakausapin ka muna ng security guard for screening and then tsaka nila manually iakaman or ililift yung parking barrier. So it could also cause damage or accident kapag biglang bumaba yung barrier at matamaan yung sasakyan. So for the building or property owners naman, kapag muna security personnel, anyone can just lift the parking barrier and makakapakas na sila sa ating establishment or area. Now since we're already talking about parking spaces, uh, isa pa sa napansin ko kapag ka sa mga parking, specifically sa mga condominiums, uh, residential buildings, or any establishment na mayroong reserved parking is yung uh, kapag nag-aagawa ng parking spaces. Uh, so even if we pull yung mga signages, unfortunately, there will be people na hindi papansin yung, yung mga signages that time uh, they're running out of parking space. So just thinking about these scenarios, uh, I can feel na yung ating mga my viewers na nanonood ngayon ay nakakalate at may stress about it. But don't worry because Ziggy Teco, the global leader in biometrics and security systems, brings the latest devices designed to effectively manage our parking areas. And I'm talking about the Ziggy Teco PV4000 series parking barrier and the Clock 2 private parking lot. Alright, let's get to know more naman yung ating mga vehicle management products. Starting off with our parking barrier, the CT Teco PV4000 series. Now, the PV4000 series is an ideal automatic car barrier. It's easy to install. It. All you need to do is to screw the device to the ground and connect it to electricity. It is also available in barrier lengths of uh, 4 meters or 6 meters. It can also pack with LED lights for indoor or underground parking spaces. Now, in terms of the uh, build and material, its motor is made of a uh, die cast aluminum alloy with double strong springs, while the uh, housing mat is made of powder coated uh, steel, which offers best protection against corrosion or pangalawa. So, sure, tayo na matibay and long lasting yung ating parking barrier. Now, another good thing about the PV4000 series is that uh, it, is, uh, it offers secure yet convenient access. So, para sa ating mga security personnel, they can use remote control. So, hindi na nila kailangan to lift or ang ating barrier manually. Now, the users can also access naman yung ating barrier using long-distance RFID or with the use of what we call UHF reader and UHF tags. And aside from that, the PV4000 series also cares about the safety ng ating mga users. Uh, first, it has a vehicle loop detector for anti-crash uh, function, meaning it can detect kung meron pang vehicles sa tapat ng ating barrier and it prevent niya yung barrier natin from closing. It also has an emergency function where during power outage, it will release yung ating manual wheel. So you can manually lift yung ating barrier kung wala yung electricity. Now, it also has a built-in cooling fan para naman ma-prevent yung overheating ng ating device. 
price. Now, with all of that said, we are confident that the CT Deco PV4000 series of our market barriers can offer long life cycle, high quality and reliability, and of course, uh, the equipment of an easy installation and maintenance. So ngayon naman, let's take a look at the City Teco Block 2 Private Parking Manager. So Block 2 is our second generation parking block, keeping all the features of Block 1 plus a new feature that makes the device more effective in securing our parking spaces. So in terms of uh, build and quality, the Block 2 has high pressure resistance of 2 to 3 tons, so it won't be a problem if ever na magulungo na sa sakyan yung atang device. So, it also has IP67 rating for dust and water resistance. So for perfect din to for outdoor installation ng ating parking lot. Kung continuous naman ang pag-uusapan, Block 2 can definitely deliver. So users can unlock the device using long-distance remote control or by using its newest feature, the auto-sensing function by simply placing a sensor in a cigarette lighter reset effect. And of course, the user safety is always a priority with ZK Teco products. That's why the Block 2 has a 180-degree anti-collision feature with built-in alarm system. So kapag may nag-attempt to take your parking space, the Block 2 will ring an alarm. So compared with the traditional or um, makeshift parking lots, Block 2 requires zero manual operation. So everything is hands-free and automated. Okay, so now, to give you a clearer picture of what our products uh, look, we have here the ZK Teco PP4000 series parking barrier. So, as you can see, our product, uh, its housing is made of a powder-coated steel, and inside the housing, may kita naman natin, uh, nasa loob nito yung ating uh, power supply, ating power source, yung ating actual na motor, and of course, yung ating controller. And dito naman sa labas, so you can observe na meron tayong uh, you have the barrier of the device which is made of uh, aluminum alloy. And then when we purchase the Ziggy Deco PP4000 series parking barrier, it would also come with your wired na remote control. And apart from that, is our uh, wireless remote control. So here it is. It comes with two wireless uh, remote control. And this one is our wired ating wired na remote control. Again, for easy and convenient access ng no, ating security personnel or whoever will be operating yung ating device. And as you can see, dito rin sa ating barrier, included din yung uh, meron tayong reflectorized sticker. So, para mas madaling makita. Even on uh, poor lighting or sa madilim na uh, spaces natin. So, mag-work pa rin or visible pa rin ating device during the night for outdoor parking spaces. And very useful din siya para mas maging visible yung ating device kapag sa mga indoor or uh, underground naman natin na parking spaces. So, over here naman is our ZK Teco Block 2 Private Parking Lab. So, uh, as you can see here, it has a very nice appearance. Double structure, easy control, uh, strong function, reliability, and security. So, masasabi din natin na matibay at durable ang ating unit because it is made of steel and it has IP67 rating which means water and dust resistant siya. So, perfect ito for outdoor installation. So, as you can see here, the yellow part of the device is the uh, parking lock wrapper. Inaccess natin siya by remote control, magde-lift and magde-decline itong parking lock wrapper natin. So, and the black part naman is where the controller and the power supply located. So, the device is battery operated. So, the, re and the recommended battery for this device is the LR20 Alkaline uh, dry battery uh, with resize speed. So once na pinurchase natin itong unit na ito, uh, it comes with of course the Black 2 unit uh, and the three pieces Dyna Bolt. Again. And it also comes with a remote control with two pieces of keys. So itong keys na to para ma-open itong um, controller na device. And another one is the cigarette lighter receptacle. So, ito yung built-in um, sensor natin na nilalagay sa loob ng sasakyan. Yan, para kapag uh, na-detect ng uh, device natin yung itong cigarette, uh, itong sensor na ito, mag-lift or mag-decline itong parking lock wrapper natin. So, this is the Ziggy Teco Lock 2 Private Parking Lock. 
Okay, so at this point, we want to show you our my viewers an actual product demonstration. So joining us in today's session is a survey, one of our technical staff, to further discuss how our parking barrier and parking locks work. Hi everyone! Today let me show you the functionality and how to operate the CV Take of Parking Barrier. So basically, it has two different setups. First is the basic setup. It only comes with wired push button and wireless remote control. So advantage, uh, it very easy to use since it is automated and it can be operated by a remote control to trigger, raise, and lower the boom barrier. So madali din, madali siyang install since plug and play and once na na-purchase na itong unit, all you need to do is to install the unit on the ground and pwede mo siyang gamitin and ready to use na siya. Ngayon naman, ipapakita kung paano yung open itong parking barrier natin. So first is by a wireless remote control. So, para yung taas natin itong parking barrier natin, uh, all you have to do is to press the arrow up button. Okay. To, to lower the boom barrier, all you have to do is press the down button. Then up. Down. Then stop. Second is a wire push button. So basically, a uh, wire push button natin is niisang natin sa uh, guard booth or sa mismong housing ng parking barrier natin. So kung sino mo kung uh, guard duty na pwede mag or i-access so pwede siya. So first button is up. Then, then last button is for down. Then up. Then down. Then nasa kitna po is up. Then down. Another setup that we can apply for this parking barrier is the advanced setup. Working, there are accessories needed to include for this setup. So later, isa-isayin natin yung mga accessories na yun. Dito yung advanced setup. So meron tayong anti-cross features wherein kailangan natin mag-install or maglagay ng loop detector or consent para ma-prevent natin yung falling ng boom barrier natin sa mga sasakyan natin. Okay, second is can record transaction na plugs in and out of the vehicle. So kailangan din natin include yung accessories like USB tags, USB reader, and also, also the CK Bio Security Software para ma-monitor natin yung mga transactions report. And then last, it can prevent the authorized vehicle to enter the premises. And then, uh, those are the special features of advanced setup. For us, to see yung mga accessories na panggit ko nina, first, USB reader. So basically, USB reader is nilalocate natin malang sa parking barrier natin. So suggested height for USB reader is 2 to, 2, 2 to 0.5 meters high. So second, uh, USM tag. We have a four different USM tag. Tag one, so hand carry ito ng mga user natin. So, tag two, uh, usually uh, nilolog ito sa, or ni-install sa motorcycle helmet, windshield, or headlight. Then, tag three, uh, nilolog ito, uh, ni-install naman ito sa uh, license plate ng mga uh, four wheels drive natin. Then top 4, so usually or basically is yes, uh, ni-install naman ito sa windshield. So yeah, then, uh, meron tayo yung mga, ayun yung mga card, mga USF tag natin. So, kung may USF tag, USF tag tayo, meron naman tayong uh, USF card issuer. So, dito natin nire-register yung mga USF tag natin. So, i-coconnect mo lang siya sa PC, so using USB cable nakasama siya na package. Then second uh, second accessories uh in by pro. So si by pro ito yung uh, access control panel natin. Then dito yung dito na nagre-record yung mga transactions logs ng parking barrier natin. Then last na accessories natin is uh, yung loop wire. So yung loop wire is in-embed siya sa ground. That then activate siya sa board of parking barrier. So si loop wire yung mag-serve as uh, anti-grass papers ng parking barrier. Ngayon naman, ipapakita ko paano mag-enroll ng mga tags using card issuer natin. So, card issuer natin, cut USB uh, USB cable lang siya, so included na siya sa 
sa box. So, all you have to do, uh, connect lang natin sa PC or sa laptop. So, once na nag-drip siya, and then may ilaw, so it means connected na siya. Then, kailangan din natin pasukin yung software natin kasi nang tayo mag-register ng mga uh, user. So, pasukin lang natin yung CK by security. So, username, admin, password, admin. So, dito tayo mag-register sa personal module. Sa personal module, click lang natin yung new. So, may lalabas tayong window. So, personal ID. So, pwede tayo mag-input ng, ng number dyan or uh, kung may sinusunod tayo yung mga uh, personal ID. For example, tag 1. Then, first name. For example, tag R1. R1. Then last name, R1. Then kailangan lang natin sa software, pumunta lang tayo sa part number field. Then kunin natin si yung step tag natin, then tap lang natin sa issuer. So mapapansin natin, nagkaroon ng bago yung card number. So meaning, yung card number na to, ito yung naroon yung number niya. Then save. Then, next na yung process natin, uh, punta tayo sa access module. Then, advance. Then, access level. So, sa access level, meron tayo yung parking barrier. So, add, add door tayo. Then, nakreate natin kanina, is still 4 to 1 3 yung unit na sample natin. Then, okay. Then after makagawa ng access level, punta naman tayo sa set, set access by levels. So dito sa access, set access by level, dito natin ipapasok yung yung ginawa natin, uh, yung in-input natin ID. So after na, once na natin na sa kapila, automatic, yung part number na to is nakano na sa, sa ginawa natin pa, uh, parking barrier. Those are the accessories needed for the advanced setup. But, it is depend on sa requirements ng client. So ngayon guys, kapag ito yung Apple demo kung paano mag-trigger open yung parking barrier natin using tags and USB framework. So guys, kung itong disclaimer lang, bali ko kapasin natin, uh, ganyan lang pa ba yung height ng USB framework natin. Pero basically, uh, ini-install yung ano natin, uh, USB framework is 2 hanggang 2.5 meters high. So, isa sa mga features ni parking bar natin is uh, pwede natin makuha yung uh, transactions report. So, all you have to do is to log in to CQBI security software natin. Then, uh, log in po tayo. So, default, na, default pa rin yung inamin natin credentials. So, from CQBI security, once na nakalag na tayo, so, punta lang po tayo sa access module. So, from access module, Contact, then go to report. Then sa reports ko, meron tayo pwede natin po yung all transactions or pwede yung event from today or pwede yung lahat ng ano, uh, unknown position. So ngayon, kung po rin natin yung lahat ng transactions, uh, punta tayo sa all transactions. So makikita natin dito lahat ng transact kay parking barrier natin. So nandiyan yung unregistered personnel. 
verify the open so pwede rin natin siyang extract so kung i-extract natin pwede tayo mag extra file pdf or csv kung ano naman kailangan ni management tayo so kung kung extract file click mo na yung okay then pwede natin siyang mag save then yan pwede natin siyang mag view using uh, sa microsoft office na Thank you very much, Sir Big, for showing us how AD4000 and ZT Techo Club 2 work. Both devices truly really offer an ideal, convenient, and efficient parking experience.
to its users. Now, if you have any other questions regarding our featured products, just let us know by commenting down below and what our associates will be glad to answer your questions shortly. And now it's time for some special announcement. First is our exclusive one-day promo for our viewers today. So you can choose to avail the ZK Tech of EV4 Factor series or the ZK Tech of Flat 2 via a 2-month installment plan or get 20% off if you purchase in full amount today. So once again, we would like to repeat that this promo is only effective when you place an order today. So send us a message on our Facebook page or you can call on the phone number flashed on your screen so we can provide you with a quotation right away. Okay, naman, we will be announcing the winner of our guest, the product of the week, Facebook game. So congratulations to our winner of 300 pesos worth of load. Your name will also be shown on the screen. So to send us a private message on our Facebook page so you will know how to claim your price. Yes, and that wraps up our third session of my webinar. Thank you very much for joining us. And since there will be a public holiday next week, you can catch us again on our last session of my webinar on April 8th, Thursday, 10 a.m. on our Facebook page and official YouTube channel where we will feature another Indian security products. So please stay tuned for that. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so you will be updated on our future uploads. Also, like, share, and follow our social media accounts to get the latest product updates, offers, news, and events. Yeah, so see you all again on our last session of my webinar. My webinar, bringing the latest biometrics and security products. Brought to you by My Solutions, real people with real solutions.